And then when a company gets to a certain level, and it depends on different entrepreneurs, they then hire a professional CEO because the business then becomes less like a speedboat and more like a large ship. It needs more procedures. It needs more processes. It needs more people who are in alignment. The pace of change of the business slows down. And often the entrepreneur in their DNA has a pace, has an energy to keep moving forward. So that's why it's so important. So the entrepreneur needs to retain, if you like, what their core focus and mission is, like Pradeep's is machine learning. And the company has its solutions. And over time, what Pradeep did was he, he employed people to replace himself in those functional areas. So I hope that makes some sense. There is a, if you like, an architecture, a process to doing that. But I think also just to recognize, saying as a dad, for example, or a founder, that there comes a time when the business is not going to need me or when I shouldn't be relevant, is not a rejection of the original business. It's not a rejection of the people in the company. It's very important to say that. Because some people say, oh, but you know, you're not loyal to the company anymore. It's not about that.